Hey music fans, as a roadie I had this great opportunity to tour with all these bands. I wrote a book about my experiences on the road and it was the number one new release on Amazon and Bios and it's now sold millions of copies on Kindle. I'm Joel Roadie and this is my podcast, Party Like a Rockstar. Hey guys, so I enjoyed this one thoroughly. This is with my buddy P. King. P. King is a fellow roadie. He's been in a production assistant and a drum tech. He's worked for Hell Yeah. That's right, he was the drum tech of Vinnie Paul. It's pretty cool. <laughs> He's worked for a baby metal. He's worked for Black Label Society. He's worked for 10 years. He's done a bunch of cool stuff. He also makes coffee. You guys can find his coffee if you're interested in checking it out at rockdcoffee.com. I'll put it on the screen there for you guys to check it out. Get some of P. King's coffee and give it a go. I was intrigued to see what he would think of Nemophila's cover of uh, Megatsuni. I do go into it a little bit after. I don't think it's necessarily just a cover. I think they did such a good job that it was more of a, uh, what do I say in the video? Homage, I think I say, but... Nonetheless, I think what they put together is cool. I think the ladies in Nemo Feeler are awesome. I think I've made that clear before. So let's see what Peking thinks, though. Let's do it. So, um, have you? So, have you ever heard of a band? I know you work for Baby Metal, but have you ever heard of a band called Nemo Fila? I'm not familiar with them, but I'd love to hear them. Okay, so they're a Japanese band. They're an all female band. I think they're really good. I think you're going to totally dig it or whatever. I assume you've heard of the song Megatsune. Yes, I have. Okay, that's enough. Let's do this. <laughs> All right, here we go, brother.
<laughs> All right, Hell so yeah. first question. What would Vinnie Paul have said? <laughs> Vinnie Paul would have said, holy shit. <laughs> really good, huh? Dude, that was badass. That was fucking amazing. These girls, oh shit. Proud of you. They know. They know what this is. They know what this is. They know. They know. Did you see all the foxes on the microphones and stuff? Oh, yeah. I love it. Yeah. You got to pay the penance to the fox god. You know what I'm saying? There we go. So, you know, one of the ideas, what's really fun is like the bands that you've had the opportunity to work for when you, this isn't really a cover, it's more of like an homage. You know, there's so much love. Yeah. They they put too much into it to just cover the song, and that's why I love these ladies. And you see all the smiling and everything; they're having so much fun, and they're really good. I mean, they're like really oh, they're fantastic. I mean, yeah, they're yeah. Really, like, but it's neat when you've worked for the uh, the original performer, and then they have these people do the homage that you're like, you know what? I gotta admit, it's it's really good. You know, so that's my thoughts. I don't. know. It's fantastic. I tell you what, to see somebody put that much into it that they can pay the homage in such a detailed way that uh, I will say in times where I've known that I've heard such a thing, real deal, incredible. So my hat's off to them. If I had a hat, it would be off to them. So, <laughs> you know, that's amazing. Deal. All right. You got time for a different band? Absolutely. Okay, cool. <laughs> Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed the show. I now have a Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, Discord, and even a Patreon. The Patreon you can join for as little as one buck. The handle on all of them, it's of course, Joel Rohde. I'll see you guys on the next one.